What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to the Madden Ballers YouTube channel and our Detroit Lions franchise. Last season, the Lions lost to Seattle in the divisional round. And now it's time for year two of the Detroit Lions franchise. The preseason, all four games in this one episode. And they start at home in Ford Field, taking on the Tampa Bay Bucks, who they beat in the regular season and also be in the playoffs in the wild card round on the road. So this year, Stafford will not be playing in the preseason. He got injured last year in the preseason. We're not going to play him this year. Off-season signing, Matt Flynn is going to start this game for the Lions. You'll see Sean Hill as well and the rookie quarterback, Anthony DeVetto, I believe it is his name. Handoff on first and ten, goes for six. Second and four here, Flynn. Going to hit rookie Ernest Sherrod for a, on a comeback route, and he's going to take off after he broke a tackle going all the way for the 79-yard touchdown catch. And Detroit's up 7-0 after two plays. Defense now for the Lion, B.J. Raji coming over from the Packers. Mike Glennon's going to find his receiver there, John Carlson for the first down catch, second and four for the Buccaneers handoff to Sean Green up the middle, still playing Sean Green, former Jet, goes for 12. Second and five now from the Lions, eight. And Glennon's going to fire the end zone and it's dropped by Carlson, a touchdown wide open and he drops it so it's third and five and they would end up kicking a field goal. Lions now still on defense here in the second quarter and Safirian Jenkins is going to grab that catch from Bennett, the backup quarterback. Going to set him up in first and 10 here inside the 20. Bennett now looking to pass. Going to the end zone and it's caught by Sherrod or Shepard. And the Tampa Bay Bucks take a 10 7 lead later in the second quarter. Bucks have the ball again. And this one's going to be picked off by Cassius Vaughn. He'll be dragged down right at the spot of the interception there. About the 15-yard line. And the Lions take over. First and 10. Sean Hill in the game now for the Lions. Hand off to Joyke Bell up the middle. That one goes for 9. And the Lions are inside the 10 now. After that run by Joyke Bell. First and goal from the 3. And Hill's going to roll out here. Fire. And it's broken up. A little off the mark there for Sean Hill. It'll be third and goal now. And Hill under center will hand out to the fullback, Jed Collins. And the Lions take the lead here late in the second quarter, 14 to 10. The Bucks would get the ball back and drive down the field here. First and goal. And they get in the end zone and take the lead at halftime, 17 to 14 over the Lions. We move on to the second half of this game here. Bucks have the ball third and four at the Lions 39 yard line. Bennett looking to pass, but he's going to go down and he fumbles the ball. Taylor's going to recover for Detroit. And the Lions take over, forcing fumbles. That's what they need to do more of this year. The rookie quarterback, Anthony DeVito, or DeVetto, in the game now. He's going to hit Michael Preston. Free agent signing. Third and ten now. DeVetto looking to pass here. Moves around the pocket and finds Ryan Broyles over the middle. He makes the first down catch. Second and goal now for the Lions from the four. A pitch out to Joyke Bell. Will get into the end zone for the touchdown. And the Lions retake the lead over the Bucks, 21-17. to Bucks have the ball now in the fourth quarter. Bennett scrambling around the pocket, steps up, fires deep, and caught by Nelson. He goes down at the 15. Third and seven now for Tampa Bay. Looking to retake the lead here. Bennett steps up, fires the end zone, lobbing it in there. Shepard's got the catch for the touchdown, his second on the day. And the Tampa Bay Bucks retake the lead, 24 to 21. The Lions would get one more Hill Mary shot here with one second left. DeVetto. His pass falls incomplete as he was hit as he was throwing. And the Lions go down 24-21. to Matt Flynn, pretty good day. 3 for 509 yards. The other two quarterbacks 
Eh, not so good. DeVetto, 6 for 13, and Sean Hill, 3 for 5. We're really going to look at these guys throughout the preseason. Sean Hill's going to get the start next week, and then DeVetto is going to get the start the final two weeks, and one of these quarterbacks will be gone. Joy Bell, though, a big day, 100, over 100 yards on the day rushing. Sherrod, two catches, and that one for 79 yards and a touchdown. So very impressive by the rookie on the day for the Lions. The Lions would move on to Washington for their second preseason game. This one's going to be a rainy, muddy game in FedEx Field. Lions hoping to get a win in the preseason. We're going to take a look at Sean Hill here with the starters this week. Last week, 60% completion percentage, only 20 yards and an interception for Hill. It's going to be between him and probably Matt Flynn for the backup quarterback position. And the loser will probably get cut. Pitch out here to Theo Riddick, though, on first play of the game is going to go for 27 yards, and we're already into Redskins territory. Hill now on first and 10 will look to pass. And he's going to go down, sacked on the play. Really needed to step up in that situation. Third and 20 now. Hill out of the shotgun is going to step up, fire. And it's caught by Jeremy Ross, the return man in there at receiver. Gets the first down catch. The Lions would add a field goal in that drive. Redskins take over, and Robert Griffin takes off into Lions territory at the 40. First and 10. Griffin going to go down, sacked by Jason Jones. And the Redskins have second and long here. Griffin looking to pass. Quick pass to Deshaun Jackson. He's got the first down and more taken down at the 20. And they're in the red zone. Griffin two for two for 27 yards. Third and four. Griffin looking. Going to take off again. And this time he's got the first down and the end zone. Griffin with the QB keeper for a touchdown. Looking like the old RG3. And Washington up 7-3. Lions in the second quarter have the ball at the Redskins 19. This one lobbed up there for Sherrod, but he cannot come down with it. And the Lions settle for a field goal. 10-6 now as the Redskins added a field goal. Third and six from their own five. And it's going to be a safety. And the Lions get two points. It'll Get the ball back. They would add a touchdown to make it 15 to 10 at halftime. We move to the second half here. We're going to see a lot of the rookie. And the Lions have the ball. Third and four at the Redskins, 17. DeVetto looking for a receiver. Finding Brandon Pettigrew and finding the end zone. The Lions extend their lead 22 to 10. Later in the third quarter, the Redskins hand the ball off to Johnson here, and he's going to find a hole on the sideline, and he is gone down the sideline inside the 10. Touchdown, Washington, and they get back within five points here, 22-17 to 17 Lions. DeVetto looking for a first down play here, and he finds Joseph Fourier up to the 32, and it looks like Fourier might have been injured. Third and eight now for the Lions from their own 34. And this catch by Ryan Broyles is going to go into Redskins territory, down at the 36-yard line, and DeVetto looking good. Six for nine for 91 yards. First and 10 from the Redskins 36. They're going to find Sherrod. He's down to the 10. First and goal, Detroit. Later on, it's second and goal. DeVetto looking, dumping off to Joy Bell, and he's in the end zone for the touchdown. And the Lions take a 29-17 lead. They end up winning 38-17 in kind of a rout here. DeVetto, a good day, 8 for 14, 125, and a couple touchdowns. Reggie Bush, 17 carries for 92 yards. Joy Bell had a touchdown on the day, actually two, I believe. Ryan Broyles, four catches, 71 yards on the day. And Travis Lewis leading the way in tackling. And we move on to preseason game number three. And I don't know why EA does this in Madden, but we're playing the Chicago Bears, our division rival, which you would never do in real life. And DeVetto getting the start. We'll find Sherrod, but he's going to fumble the ball, and the Bears will take over 
Third and inches, the Lions looking for a stand to try to hold him to a field goal. Hand off to Johnson, and he will be stuffed behind the line, and the Lions hold the Bears to a field goal. 3-0 Chicago. DeVetto and the Lions take over again, and this pass deep, off the mark, incomplete. And DeVetto not looking good early here. Third and 12. DeVetto looking. Firing, and that one's off the mark as well, incomplete. And the Lions go three and out. Second quarter, Lions have the ball again. Matt Flynn in the game, and that catch is good by Golden Tate. Up at the 20, it's second and one. Flynn looking to pass. Got a fire over the middle for the end zone, and caught by Sherrod. And that's his second or third touchdown this preseason. He's looking good. I believe he was our best rated overall player from the draft. The Lions had the lead at halftime over the Bears. 15 to, I believe it was 13 or 10. It's now 15-16. And Joseph Fourier going to get a 33-yard touchdown catch from, was that Sean Hill or was that, that was Matt Flynn. Two-point conversion. The Lions are going to go for it. And Golden Tate's going to reel in that catch for the two-point conversion. And it's 23 to 16. Later on in the third, the Lions hit the ball again in Chicago territory. Handoff to Theo Riddick. That one's going to go for 11. Second down and six. Handoff to Riddick again. He's going to bounce off a tackle, break another tackle, and finally pick up the first down inside the five. And Theo Riddick will cap this drive off from the two with a touchdown. And the Lions open up this game against the Bears, though they would make a semi-comeback here. Third and one, the Lions defense trying to stand tall here, and they're going to get the quarterback for a sack and hold them. Later on here, it's first and goal for the Bears, and the pass off to Johnson going nowhere. Third and goal. Looking for the end zone. The Bears will be sacked and stopped for a field goal there. Late in the fourth quarter, they have the ball inside the red zone once again. Third and three, and the Lions hold once again, hold them to a field goal, and the Lions get the victory 30 to 22 over the Bears. Not a very good day for rookie quarterback, Anthony DeVetto, five for 13, 49 yards. Matt Flynn, pretty good day, seven for 15. 173 yards on the day. Theo Riddick, 18 carries, 107 yards. Our running game has looked really good this preseason. All three running backs. Ernest Sherrod, four catches, 57 yards, and a touchdown. He's looking good this preseason as well. And we move to our fourth and final preseason game in Lambeau Field, another divisional game. Don't know why they do this, but the Lions could not win in Lambeau last year, week 17, to get the division win. Anthony DeVetto will start, 47.5 completion percentage, 243 yards, and a touch to two touchdowns. But he hasn't made those mistakes as far as turnovers. The Lions looking to win in Lambeau, even if it's the preseason in the last 24 years, 23 years. This catch caught for 17 yards, third and nine. DeVetto going to fake the handoff, roll out to his left, looking. He's going to shake off a sack attempt, but the second one's going to get him, and the Lions have to punt. The Packers take over. Aaron Rodgers here will hand off to Eddie Lacy. He's going to cut it up the middle. Spin move, and he's in the open field. He will be taken down, though, at the 39. That's a 32-yard gain. Later in the drive at second and four, Rodgers going to take off. He's a dual-threat quarterback, probably one of the most prolific dual threats. He can run with the best of them. Third and six now for the Packers. Rodgers looking. He's going to fire here. And this one's going to be picked off by Cassius Vaughn. He's had a good preseason. And Aaron Rodgers throws an interception in Lambeau. Doesn't do that a lot, but it won't turn into any points for the Lions. Late first quarter. Rodgers is going to find Jordy Nelson for a first down catch into Lions territory. Second down and ten. Rodgers is going to pass again. After shaking off that sack attempt, he'll find Jordy Nelson wide open down inside the 20. And the Green Bay Packers would add a field goal from that drive. The Lions take over here in the first quarter late. 
and DeVetto's going to find Preston. Preston's going to be short of the marker, but a flag comes in. That's going to be a face mask penalty, and the Lions' drive would continue here. First and 10, DeVetto firing, finding Preston. He's had a pretty good preseason here, probably fighting for a top spot in the receiving core, top four, top five. DeVetto going to find Eric Ebron, the second-year man, second-year tight end. That's going to put the Lions in field goal range, and they kick a field goal. Halftime, 3-3, a very defensive game here in Lambeau Field as we move to the second half here, second down and eight for the Packers, and I believe that is... It's either Smith or Kellen Moore, the former Lion, throwing the interception. The Lions take over here. And Matt Flynn playing the second half here. He's going to go deep here. Wide open, Preston. He's got the catch. We have second and goal now from the one. Flynn looking, trying to take off. Shakes off two sack attempts. He's going to run and then fire and caught by Preston, I believe that was. Or was that Sherrod? That was Sherrod. So he's got three or four touchdowns this preseason. He might have just earned himself the number three position at receiver. The, the Lions, though, up 10-6 now, and the Packers have the ball at their own four. We got a seven-yard pass and catch there. They would pick up the first down, second down and 10. Smith going to be almost picked off there by a head of bow, which could have probably ended the game, third and 10. Smith looking to pass here as he's in as Kellen Moore is injured, and he's going to find Bostic for a first down catch. They're now up their own 25. Looking to pass again here, second and 18. Smith is going to find Lacey, and Lacey has the first down up at the 44. It's now second down and four from the 50. Smith dumping it off to Bostic. He's got a first down catch into Lions territory. Under two to go. Fourth and three for the Packers. If we get this one, we stop them. But no, Bostic with another big catch for a first down. And the Packers get to hurry up mode here. Smith now second and four will find Starks over the middle for a first down catch. And they're inside the 10. And they're hurrying it up once again with under a minute to go. It's fourth and goal. Flag in on the play, but they let it play out. And Ch Childress gets the catch and the touchdown. The flag is on the Lions. And the Green Bay Packers take the 13-10 lead. Fourth and 23 for the Lions with 13 to go. Flynn's going deep, and it's going to be caught by Ryan Broyles, the 50. And a face mask penalty will put him up at the 32. And one last shot here. Flynn going for the end zone. He's going to be picked off by Stewart. And the Packers continue their dominance over the Lions at home in Lambeau Field. And get the victory, 13-10. Matt Flynn, 8 for 16, 147. DeVetto, 5 for 7, 75. A pretty good day for him. Sean Hill, 2 for 4. Michael Preston, a good day, 6 for 121. Sherrod, another touchdown on the day for him in this preseason. And it's come to cut day, and we're going to cut Sean Hill. Matt Flynn will be our backup. DeVetto will be the third string quarterback for the Lions. We're going to save a million dollars in cap space there. Chaz Cobb, one of our draft picks, is going to be cut as well. Corbin Porter, another draft pick, will be cut as well. And also Norman Beatty there will be cut. He was one of our draft picks. We didn't have a very good draft. And Wyatt Garrett, the center, will also be cut as well. And we will move on in the next episode to the first week of the regular season. A team we played last year in the regular season the New Orleans Saints, we will travel to the Superdome to take on Drew Brees and the New Orleans Saints. Well, that's if, if Drew Brees is even playing for the Saints anymore. I haven't checked. But if you like this episode, give it a thumbs up. The Lions franchise is back for year two. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. And we'll catch you guys in the next episode.